Triumph has updated the Trident 660 for 2025 in some of the international markets. The motorcycle has received new electronic aids and some changes to its suspension setup. The middleweight British Roadster has received a six-axis IMU for 2025. As a result, cornering ABS and traction control come as standard with cruise control joining the list of updates. Triumph has also made the bi-directional quick shifter a standard equipment, unlike its predecessor, for which it was available as an option. The 2025 Trident 660 has also received a 41mm Showa separate function fork big piston, SFFBP, unlike the previous lower spec SFF units. Plus, the top yoke is now a forged aluminium unit. The rear monoshock, meanwhile, has remained unchanged. Powering the motorcycle is the same 66cc inline triple engine that continues to produce 80 Bo-Okshpu and 64 nm. However, there's a new sport ride mode joining the existing road and rain modes, which delivers power in a more responsive and alert manner. The addition of a six-axis inertial measurement unit, the sort of thing that was exclusive to high-end superbikes just a few years ago, means the 2025 Trident gains lean, sensitive cornering ABS and traction control as standard. Affordable computing power also means Triumph has been able to add its Triumph Shift Assist Quick Shifter, complete with downshift blipper and cruise control to the bike for 2025. The Bluetooth connectivity module, previously an option, has been made standard to give phone connectivity and turn-by-turn -turn navigation on the small TFT display that sits below the LCD that shows speed and RPM in the upper section of the single circular instrument. An ambient temperature display is also added, as well as an additional sport riding mode to accompany the existing road and rain settings. But the changes aren't purely in the bike's computers. While the on-paper specs of the suspension seem like the original version, with a 41mm inverted Showa fork and a preload adjustable monoshock from the same brand, the parts are new. The braking hardware remains unchanged and comprises 310mm dual disc up front and a single 255mm disc at the rear, both sourced from Nissan. The 2025 Triumph Trident 660 has been introduced in four color options, three of which are new, including Cosmic Yellow, Cobalt Blue, and Diablo Red. The Jet Black paint scheme remains the same. Considering the updated model is priced the same as before in Europe, we expect Triumph to follow the same theme for India, where it costs 8.25 lakh, X showroom. The advent of the Speed 400 and Scrambler 400's X might mean Triumph's Trident 660 is no longer the brand's entry-level model, but it remains the lowest cost route onto one of the company's signature triples and has proved a huge success since its debut four years ago. For 2025, the Trident gets its first round of updates, and while they're not visible, they represent a substantial step forward in terms of tech and come with no increase to price in the US.